We are broadcasting live from Don't Ever Bank Here Field in Cracksome Skull, Florida, where elections can't be broken because <laughs> they're always fixed. The fans are ready for some mutant football. Well, I'm going to make like a presidential election ballot and disappear because I got to pee. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers and lots of lots of beers. The insane Colts go up against the Cracksome Skull Jugulars. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. If you like your cocktail cold, your soup hot, and your steak still mooing, then you're going to love seeing mutants not cold, their brains turn into hot lava soup, and their bodies strewn about the field, lying still and barely moving. NFL game day is on the air. Oh, you just made me hungry, Grim. I'm going to go get some of them extra crispy mutant finger strips. Hey, get me a full slab of broken mutant ribs while you're there. And it's first and ten. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you son of a bitch. And it's first and ten. was there, but he still picked up a yard somehow. Second down and nine. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, oh, going in circles. <laughs> <laughs> and it's first and ten. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well placed. Hey, yeah, Briggs, check the rule book. Is that a penalty? Why would I have the rule book? Oh, for fuck's sake. I don't even get how much. First down in less than a. It's a jailbreak. And the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Ho oh, ho. Crowd's loving it. It's going to a play, but the blow up on a play? the team. I should learn from this. He's dead, you moron. Yeah. And it's first and ten. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. First and ten. Oh, great throw! Great catch! And then put six points on the board! The defense couldn't do anything to stop a throw that good, Grim! You mean aside from bribing the ref, killing the quarterback, or actually playing some D? Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitting. The kick is good! And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The 
best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. Third down and, well, good luck. He had nowhere to go and got nothing out of it. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Oh, with the punishing hit. And it's first and ten. Good throw, good catch, but not quite good enough at nine yards. And that'll bring up second and one. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed. And that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. And it's first and ten. Oh, devastating hit! You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. The offense is running low on running backs. They have only two left. They need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. And it's first and ten. And the ball razors through the defense, cutting a defender in half. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown! Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. And that's another turnover for the defense. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. 
Because he just walked all over him. <laughs> And it's first and ten. They're taking what the defense has given them. That's a four-yard gain on the reception. Hey, less than a white for the headache. Second down and six. And the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 90.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Well. And it's first and ten. They pick up three on a short pass. Second down and seven. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to fight it. And this guy's like a human cannonball. First of all. Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the rep didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. And it's first and ten. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to... Don't you just love the sound of the bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when... And if you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> well, there's your answer, Brix. <laughs> I know, I hate those zebra men. <laughs> First and goal. The defense had enough with this ref and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> yeah, good game for time. And it's first and ten. The defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. The quarterback can't dump it. And now they're going to dump his ass. <laughs> Second down in a mile. And he just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. And it's first and ten. Don't worry. If he shots you to death, maybe he can shot Oh, and the defender knocked the ball out when he was in midair. It is a fumble indeed. Fumble Banji! The new game from Wilton Crabtree. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And the defense gets another pick. Oh, with the brutal hit. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. And it's first and ten. He 
might have managed to dig out a yard on that one. Not my yard. Got too much buried in, you know, the usual money, bodies, coffee cans filled with, well, uh, you know, mostly coffee. Tastes better, like that's good. Burying salmon heads, kimchi. How many in anything really tastes good? First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. And that's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there. Second down and two. running back no rest for the weary the last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die first and four and that was a bone crusher right there folks the offense has no running backs left so this becomes a passing only offense can still run it with their QB, right, Finn? Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it! And that'll bring up second and one. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? Oh, mama! He just knocked him into the next time zone! Lucky find his head! And it's first and ten. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is going to hit. Oh, he just got popped big time. Oh my God, I thought his head was going to pop off like a big zit. <laughs> And it's first and ten. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. Receiver just got smashed. Not as bad as me last night. He may be dead, but trust me, he's in better shape than I am right now. Oh, geez, here it comes. Blah. And I've had it. I'm oh, he got mugged. More like a mafia hit. And it's first and ten. Kind of remind me of that painting of dead carbon <laughs> turkey. The whole family smiling. Except this dad has a chainsaw and the turkey is screaming for his life. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, yeah, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. And it's first and ten. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB... Oh, what a brutal hit! Oh, and you can bury that guy, because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more! And it's first and ten. Look at that little mutant run! Ah, I don't think you can say that, Grim! Oh, boy. And that'll bring up second and one. Man, oh man, he hit that line the way your wife
life. It's the all-you-can-eat buffet of crab apple trees, Bricks. Ah, uh, you're telling me. She ate 47 Salisbury steaks one time. Thought she had food poisoning. Turns out her low intestines just exploded. No, that's a relief, because there's nothing worse than food poisoning. Oh, uh, you're telling me. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. the extra point attempt. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. Well, I turned out the line, it wasn't a broad in my bed, it was a chimp wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? Second down and seven. Something went very wrong with that box away. What was your first hit? A lack of blood, everyone having all their limbs? Danger. And they'll bring him third down and seven. Rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completions. And he finds open space, is running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. And this werewolf is from London, I believe, signed in the offseason. Yeah, I saw him at Trader Dick's hotel party the other night. His hair was perfect. Better watch out, he'll rip your lungs out, Bricks. The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Win, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. Uh, the, the funeral expenses, that is. You know, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It's good. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why we made this clothing company, Lukewarm Threads. They're mocking Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. Turner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. And it's first and ten. They could not connect on that play. Second down and ten. That ball was almost intercepted. Third down and ten. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot. He broke free and has open field in front of him. He's at the 40. They're gaining on him. Hey, come on, move your ass. I got a boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim.
And it's first and ten. Ah, another interception. Geez, you give this guy a bigger... Ooh, that hit's gonna shave a few days off his life. Hey, man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, Pop? In a hurry-up offense, there's no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. Oh, with the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. The quarterback calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. And that's another pick. And a man. What a hit that was. <laughs> and it's first and ten. <laughs> the quarterback had no time to throw, and the defense gets a big sack. Second down and a lot. Three yard catch on the play. Every little bit counts. Those three yarders, I grow up the. At the end of quarter two, it's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show sponsored by Monsatan Industries, makers of great killer products like Groundup. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning. We're back from the second half in a blowout. The teams line up for the kickoff. What a game is this close as the score indicates. <laughs> When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And it's first and ten. And that, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. And they just popped his eyes in the back of his head. That quarterback can be hurting, or dead, or worse. <laughs> Second down and a very lot. Oh, the defender almost picked off the ball on that one. Third down and long. really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, that, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on the air. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. And 
it's first and ten. Like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. It sounds like my off season. <laughs> and it's first and ten. It's not the worst speed I We know this quarterback likes to play with soft balls, but the defense, they're playing with big balls and just crushed his balls. That's a lot. You can't keep a good mutant down. Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. And he was stuck to him like glue. Second down and ten. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completions. He is fighting for every yard. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Oh, and the defense jumps outside. <laughs> oh, wow. If you're a defender, the only good QB is a dead one, Bricks. Oh, he must be pretty good then, because he is dead. The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Yeah, this new QB don't even look too confident. He's pleading with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. First down and three. Second down and long. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't know almost throw interceptions, but oh, that's a big time hit. You ever been hit like that before, Bricks? Uh, have you seen my beer? And it's first and ten. No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. And he just, he's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. Third and four. For a first oh man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. And it's first and ten. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast hand of sale with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, nah, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep.
And I'm trying to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And he breaks away. And it's first and ten. The quarterback passes the ball and it rebounds back. He can't get rid of it. It's like me and these crabs, Grim. Yep, the defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick and the QB is in a heap of trouble now. Second down in a mile. Ah, another interception. He should give this guy a big Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. Should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Say what? Come on, man. You can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm going to ruin your world. You understand me? Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. needs a miracle. And he sends him to the ground with... Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's it. And the cracks and skull jugulars decimate the opposition today and win by forfeit. There's not much left of the opposition and the fans are loving it. There was only one way this game was going to end and that was in a forfeit. That's not quite true, Grim. The alien spacecraft could have crashed into the stadium and ended the game. Oh, how about it? How about if you shut the hell up right now and we go down to the field and listen to what the MVP has to say? <laughs> with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every up.